Good morning, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on September 18th, 2022. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet, and welcome to a quick video update here, as we're going to be looking at the tropical systems and as well, a huge megastorm that is moving into Alaska. Looking here at projection models for Nan Modal, which is the typhoon affecting Japan right now. Long-range forecast shows it eventually hitting East Russia and then scooting eastward into Alaska. Now, we're going to be looking at some major swells here, looking at the wave height for the next couple days, forecast from Typhoon Nan Modal, as it will be heading towards Alaska in this long-range forecast. Looks like Thursday making landfall, all along the shores of the Aleutian Islands, you're going to be looking at six to eight meter waves. Parts of northern BC, BC coastline, you're going to be seeing at least four to five meter waves from these huge swells from a large low pressure system coming from the West Pacific. Will be affecting Alaska and northern BC. Taking a look here at the windy forecast models making landfall, and as well some cooler temperatures coming around behind that. Looking at the moisture here, you're going to see an atmospheric river of moisture heading towards the middle coast of British Columbia, and then right up the coastline into Alaska. And look at all the snow falling across the north right now. Things are definitely going to change here pretty quick, thanks to the typhoon Nanmodal. As all of these systems have been tracking in a weird path over the past six months. Now, same thing kind of happening here. Pretty large uh, Hurricane Fiona looking at the forecast models as it is making landfall today, Puerto Rico, and then Monday, Tuesday, Santa Domenico, and then it's going to head straight northward now. See how things can change quickly. Just two days ago, forecasted, this thing to make landfall, Carolina, and it's going to be scooting northward towards Newfoundland, making landfall Saturday, the 24th of September. Look at the wind models here. You're going to be seeing some very gusty winds, extreme winds, and as well, 9 to 10 meter waves. So huge swell coming along with this Hurricane Fiona as it's heading towards Newfoundland. Thoughts and prayers going out to everybody affected by Hurricane Fiona. As I said, making landfall right now, Puerto Rico, and then Santa Domenico, and eventually Newfoundland. Now watching the long-range forecast here as these systems are going to be heading northeastward into Iceland. And then you're going to see a huge northern push and strong winds heading into Europe, Central Europe, the United Kingdom. So big storms are coming in the Northern Hemisphere right now. Things ramping up, getting ready to transition into autumn. We've also got some cold temperatures as well starting to move in. Eastern North America will be cooling off quickly. We have three active tropical storms right now. This is a look at Fiona, as it is a downgraded Category 1 tropical storm, but it is going to ramp up into possibly a 3 or 4 by the time it hits Newfoundland, so heads up. Also looking at here, live imagery of Nanmodal making landfall Japan. going to leave you here looking at our southern hemisphere polar vortex right now as it is oddly shaped dipping right up into the south atlantic anomaly thanks for watching today i hope you enjoyed the video very valuable information here please share it with your friends and family much love stay aware and prepared stay young and have fun and get your daily due bye bye now
enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.